some tubing. We got four by four tubing, it's a quarter inch thick. When you're doing anything stitching, now this isn't for structural, you can get it engineered, uh, you can get an engineer to sign it off. Sometimes they, they make uh, allowances for that. It's gonna be minimal, but generally you're using full uh, pieces of material, whether it's I-beams, whether it's channels, and whether it's columns or posts or, or tubing. So, but there are cases that aren't structural where we'll make, we'll have to stitch something together, right? To, to utilize it. When you're doing this, a couple of keys, when you're doing a stitch, this one was tacked together. A couple of keys you wanna do is gotta be straight. You want it to maintain straightness. How do you do so? Well, a couple things, a couple tips. Inside, if you can see inside there, we've got a seam on this tubing. If you can get it, get the tubing to match, you wanna put it, you wanna match up your seams, especially if it's off the same run, right? So that's that, that's just one thing. It's a small thing, but it's still a thing nonetheless. The other thing you need to do is we need to bevel. We need to put a bevel on this. It doesn't have to be straight, clean, straight, but we need to put a bevel because that's where your weld's gonna fill, okay? So we need to put a bevel. It's supposed to be half of your material thickness. So if it's quarter inch, what is that? Uh, so you want to get a, enough bevel to half of your material thickness. So you're going to do that all the way around on both pieces. So it's if you're taking a plate test, you know that's what it's that's the equivalent it's, it's similar similar application right the other thing there's a couple of ways to do this the other thing is um you can let me grab this right here you can get, this is probably too big yeah that's too big you can get a tab uh, let's see if we can find something like this we'll just utilize this Man, it's too big still um, let me find a piece. able to line up and we tack that in there now when you make your weld and you can do a better attach there now it gives you a backer plate when you when you insert it so you have something that you can actually burn off of but the whole point is you got to get complete penetration so that's what the bevel does so we get the bevel you can put the backer plate or not. You don't totally have to, but it's just a thing. The other thing is keeping it straight. This, it's gotta be straight. It's gotta be flush this way. It's gotta be flush every which way, you know. The other thing, it's gonna bend. Anytime you put heat, it's gonna warp, it's gonna bend, we're gonna bow. We gotta get it clamped, you gotta get it solid, all right? This table is not clean. Workspace, in this application, We'll, on this table, what we do a lot is we tack it to the table because we don't have clamps. Uh, we don't. We can't clamp a lot of stuff to this. Utilize that. And then we can get our plate or get something and clamp it to this to make sure we're square. Make sure it's flush. 
Again, this plate isn't the best plate. But you utilize your clamps, utilize your scrap material, and do something to assure that it's gonna be straight. And this is all before, so now this is flush. If it's flush on here, now all you have to do is clamp it on this side in order to maintain your flush on this way. That's one direction. And then you check this again, this direction. Check our flatness, get it lined up and then we pack it up and weld it out. But again, while maintaining it solid, it's gotta stay the same, it's gotta stay in place. If you let it go, it's gonna freak. This one was done yesterday, and if you look down it, you can probably see it's not straight because none of that was, what I showed you was done. So that's what happened uh, when that, because of the heat. Um, so that's, that's what, you know, Future F, that's what we wanna do when you're stitching something together. Utilize your clamps, utilize your table, just use your tools, um, anything. It's take some extra steps, but in order to get the proper result, that's what you want to do. KBG Welding.